All right, welcome to the video. Anthony here with Hawkeye Traders. We're going to talk through um, and give an example of the six ways the market moves, okay? So markets can only do a handful of things. They can trend, that trend can pause, we can enter congestion, we can remain in congestion, we can exit congestion, or the trend itself can in fact reverse. So what is a trend? A trend is identified when you can see that the price, like it is right here, rising above the trend dots, okay? So this is a perfect example of what a trend looks like. Now, a period of congestion, so when we enter congestion is when the market starts to go sideways. You can notice these little orange pivot dots start to surround the price action for a period of time, okay? So that's an, an entry into congestion, a short period of congestion, and an exit of congestion is when the trend has resumed, meaning the price is now trading again above the trend dots, okay? And the market goes through these cycles constantly. It's going to impulse or trend, it's going to then again enter a period of congestion, that congestion can be very clear um, and obvious by just simply, again, looking for those pivot dots. You can see those pivot dots right there, those orange dots mean that, hey, uh, Mr. and Mrs. Trader, you should be aware we're in a period of congestion. So we enter congestion, we're in congestion, we exit congestion again when the price resumes back above the trend dot so that's the congestion exit okay and that's gonna that cycle is gonna repeat itself until the trend finally comes to an end right or there's a actual reversal and the reversal looks very much like this okay you can see that we've made a topping pattern we've fallen through the trend dots and we've now started to spend time below the red trend dots okay prices below here were entered at the moment in a period of congestion. All right, so we're just sitting there in a period of congestion, waiting for either a reversal to take us back higher or the trend to continue and take us lower. So from this scenario, we could encounter a trend reversal and go back higher, or we can get a congestion exit and the trend continue to go back to the downside. Guys, that's the long and short of just how the market is able to move within price action.